Here we go, another two for two video. And today's topic is a little bit different. It's December, 2016, and it's just been over a year and a little bit for the M Square channel. As you may know, I've been putting out videos every Thursday for the last year or so. This is sort of like a, a review for the year. Done skits, done in cover talk, street interviews. I've done a couple social experiments, little low key social experiments, VFX videos. So some of the Halloween videos where I'm actually dressed up as a, a different character, Goku or Raiden. If you haven't seen those, have a look pretty cool it took a bit of time to edit but um i think it turned out really really well mario who you guys probably don't see on camera all the time it's behind the scenes i met mario through craigslist because he posted an ad uh, wanting to be a camera guy or help be involved in filming and i was looking for a camera guy because i like being in front of the camera and mario is kind of shy so he doesn't like to be in front of the camera I try to force it, I try to get him to do interviews. So like a Vancouver talks with Mario. Give this video a thumbs up if you want to see Mario in front of the camera and I'll be behind the camera recording and he does the Vancouver talks. Shyness could be a topic. I replied to his ad, we met up at English Bay in Vancouver. It was quite awkward in the beginning and he was quite shy. But, you know, once we started filming and once we started working together, it's, you know, jokes back and forth, trolling each other. Worked out pretty well. He is the perfectionist. So there's headbutting, um, which is fine because, you know, I like to get my videos, you know, edited and done and, and online and, and and work on the next one. And he likes to just, just edit that video and make it perfect. And sometimes it bothers me, but you know what? I like him more for that, you know, to cover the side that I'm not a perfectionist. I definitely would like to get work done and I like to get edits done. I like to get videos done. Um, I have lots and lots of ideas. It's on a big list and I want to get through a bunch of those ideas. He's taught me to sort of step back a little bit and look at the video and see if there's something that I can fix. Two edits, one step back. Thanks Mario. Hopefully 2017 brings us more videos, more excitement, more fun, more trolling. Vancouver Talks street interview videos are the most frustrating videos that me and Mario film and edit and put together, mainly because it's going on the street and randomly asking people to come in for an interview. The coming up Vancouver Talks Christmas video, we were there in the cold situated on, on Robson Street. Mario and I, mainly me, was getting frustrated because I was being asking you know, 10 people to do an interview and I've got rejected or denied an interview for the first 10 and I'm standing there, I'm freezing my butt off and I'm not getting anything. And then uh, I get one person that just enthusiastic, more enthusiastic than I was to do the interview. Mario and I went, I know why we do these interviews. The realization then and there hits more and to the heart because of the cold and the time of year and uh, how many uh, rejections I got in the beginning. We do those interviews, not for the channel, it's for people. We do the interviews for people. Even if you get rejected 20 times over and I get that one enthusiastic person to do an interview with me, it's well worth it to meet that one person out of 20. One person out of 100. Hopefully not because it doesn't come down to 100 people that I ask and 99 people say no and the 100th one says yes. That would be quite frustrating. But if it does come down to that, I'm still doing Vancouver Talks. I'd like to say thanks to all the actors and actresses, pretty much my friends and new friends that I've met through doing videos. Um, thank you for being involved in my lame videos. Also, thanks to all the people on the street that I've done interviews with. You guys were awesome. You made Vancouver Talks what it is now. So 30 plus Vancouver Talk videos with 30 plus different topics. Hopefully 2017 brings us more Vancouver Talks. I'm looking forward to that. Thanks to everyone that's watched M Square videos, that liked videos, that shared our videos, that has subscribed to our channel, followed us on Instagram, all that kind of stuff. Thank you guys. Even though there's a small portion of you guys watching, how do I feel about 2017 coming up? I'm looking forward to it. I, I like the spring, the summer. It's always fun to film in the summer. Vancouver in the winter is slow. Everybody's inside and finding stuff to film in the cold and 
whatnot is, is a little bit difficult. People don't really want to stop and do interviews. Thanks for watching. Share, like, subscribe. And uh, Happy New Year. Happy Holidays. Good luck in the New Year, everybody. We'll see you in the New Year, 2017. M Square out.